Hey, if you're like me, you've probably been thinking about your current emergency preparedness kit. And um, with all the devastation we've seen from the hurricanes and stuff, what you would do if you were placed in that situation. And um, it had me th thinking about what I would personally do. And I recently got this trail wash uh, water kit system. And I think this would be an excellent, uh, nice to have to put in your emergency preparedness kit if you're able to do so. Is this totally necessary? Absolutely not. But I, I think there's a couple of really big points of why it would be a really nice thing to have, especially if you are with your family, um, if you're taking care of elders, or if you end up with a larger group of people that don't have power, don't have running water. Um, this system right here would be a godsend for you to be able to boost morale, keep your hygiene uh, well maintained, and uh, just help camp life be a little bit easier. Um, and so the reason I think this thing is super awesome is because one, if you don't have power or anything, this is a totally battery operated water system. So you just flick a switch and it, you got instant water. And this water jet is gonna allow you to clean plates and dishes very efficiently and fast, wash your hands. Um, but then this kit also comes with a full shower system and what makes this shower system uh, very nice is like yes it's it's all very quick to click in but uh, it's all about the water efficiency so you got five gallons in this scepter water tank but they designed uh, this water nozzle or a shower head to be able to um, conserve water uh, that way you get a high pressure water uh, a high pressure shower while saving all this water and then everybody uh, can get clean and feel nice and like th that is such a huge morale boost if you're stuck in an emergency situation um, where just one little thing can really just get your mood to be able to, to be in a good mindset to figure out what's going on and be able to take care of yourself um, and then of course you also have a uh, multi uh, a nozzle with a bunch of different spray settings that's also very useful and the shower system comes with a uh, suction cup uh, so you can stand up and take a nice shower you can put it on any pretty much any flat surface attach it to your car window or to a door or a window or something like that um, but so I've seen this battery last several tanks so like if you're out overlanding which this kit is designed for you're out overlanding it'll last you at least 14 days without needing to be recharged. But here's the easy thing. You're like, well, we don't have any power or anything like that. Well, the battery can be plugged into your generator, but it's also a USB chargeable battery. So you, if you have a car that's working, um, you can just hook it into your car without having to have an inverter or anything like that. Um, or if you have a backup uh, battery power supply like to charge a cell phone or something like that, you could easily recharge this guy and uh, you'd be back in business for an extended period of time. And so why is this awesome for an emergency kit? Well, now you have a dedicated water system. So if you are like, maybe you're gonna stay in a shelter in place and then you're like, well, we need to get out of here. Well, you have your dedicated water system that you can easily take, put in your car. If you have a jerry can holder, that's what it's designed for, go in the jerry can. Or you can just put it right into any regular car. It's very compact and you have all your supplies right here um, and you're ready to go. Um, and if you're like, well, we got dirty water. So if you are prepared, maybe you have a uh, Sawyer uh, filter that you can use the hose that comes with it and attach it to this nozzle and actually pump directly out the Sawyer filter if you end up putting dirty water in here or if you're not sure the water is safe if you have to get it from another source. Um, but you could always filter beforehand, boil, and put everything in here. So if you want a hot shower and you have fire and a pot, you can boil a bunch of water, put it in here, and then everybody gets to take a nice hot shower um, without any running water or power available, which would be a, a massive uh, morale boost. So just to recap, I think this is going to help you uh, have a dedicated water system. You're going to have a bulletproof, tough 
system that's not going to break down during an emergency. Um, and you're going to be able to keep morale high. Uh, you can drink out of this. Uh, you'll be able to do all your hygiene, wash your tools and equipment, wash, take showers and people, keep everybody happy. And it just makes um, life in camp just a little bit simpler versus trying to use water out of bottles or jugs or something that's not really designed uh, or efficient at cleaning and doing all your daily tasks that humans have to do without running water. So that's just my thoughts. Um, let me know what you think. Um, if you got the means and you're more uh, prepared minded, I think this would be a great addition to your kit if you can do it. Have a great day.